So do you have pain and stiffness in the lower neck or upper back or both? In this video, I show you the number one cause of painful muscle knots in those areas and how to release and relieve. Before we get to the video, there are certain red flags and contraindications associated with neck pain you need to know. Luckily, 99% of cases we see in clinic, we can help with. However, if you've got any of these red flags associated here, please consult your GP for further testing. Some of the main issues we can help with in clinic is neck pain with any of these associated problems. When we have pain in the lower neck, upper back, between the shoulder blades, that's usually not muscle pain, it's referred pain coming from the spine and nerves in this area, and it's the result of poor posture or if you work on a computer or laptop all day. Okay, so this is an example of a really good thoracic curve when you're sitting down and a really good cervical curve. Nice gentle cervical or neck curve, a nice gentle thoracic or upper back curve. Now, in really bad posture, or especially for you guys who work on computers all day, what we frequently start to see is something that looks a little bit more like this. Okay, so this presses, places a lot more stress on the lower neck and the upper back, especially these local nerves in this area, and it can refer pain out into the lower neck and upper back. Now, as chiropractors, what we do is we adjust the spine back into a better position over time. However, what can you do yourself on your own? Well, if you have another person, they can find these knots with your help. Simply rest your head forward and give yourself a big hug. The other person will try to find these knots with your help. So for the finder, feel the bumps in the spine all the way down the center of the back. Stay two fingers out on both sides and these two lines are your targets. Simply work down when you find a painful point, press in and wiggle for about 30 seconds each. This should be uncomfortable but never painful for the person. So hopefully this has helped release and relieve your myofascial trigger points but please understand that the main root cause of this is really bad posture in the upper thoracic spine.